Hey guys, it's Full Cards here, live and direct from Brooklyn, New York. And from me here, I have a box of 2020-21 Upper Deck OPG for you, me, and Dupree. It's been around since 1933. Uh, so this is the old school tactile, third liner, fourth liner, Easter eggs. Not about hits, guys. This is about cards you can destroy. They're for kids. Uh, you can get them for 45 bucks American half the time, most of the time. So just enjoy the replete, dense, uh, old school tip of the hat nod of OPG. The other thing is I will be giving away this card. Uh, it's an Upper Deck Portfolio Auto Vieri Curry. So hashtag Curry under this video, only under this video, and you can win this. And I probably am also gonna give away the OPG materials from an older set uh, that I'll throw in there. So uh, enter into that draw. Configuration, 10 cards per pack, 18 packs per box, which would amount to 180 cards. Base set, one through 550, a ton of cards. High series of 551 through 600, which would be marquee rookies, legends, season highlights, league leaders, and team checklist. So within a box break, expect 12 of those high series cards, uh, 18 base retros, two retro blacks. We should expect six of the blue border parallels, four OPG Premier Tall Boys, four OPG Playing Cards. I believe the aces amount to about 15% hits, the short prints. Uh, one red border parallel, one other chase card. So there's the patch cards. I think the gritty is the rarest commodity of those. There's a uh, draft pick puzzle piece bounty pieces, which are 19% of the time. Stanley Cup final moments, 2% of the time. Retro Cup captain, 0.8% of the time. Glossy rookies, 1% of the time. And then look for hot boxes, guys, they exist. And all of the unannounced Easter eggs, like the OPG platinum previews, the 3Ds, uh, rookies, the black and whites, the photo variations, and typically there's also some blank backs. So there's all kinds of stuff going on in here, guys. And so let's crack it open. Let's uncake and unbake this cake. Uh, so we know the rookie class, the Keeper Bellows, uh, Foodie, Jake Evans of the Habs, uh, Norris, Geeky, Baudin, a bunch of cats. Uh, we should be familiar with them. And the real good ones are either Redemptions or of course they typically would be Updeck Series 2 inserts. So look for those 3D uh, chase cards. Those are really cool chase rookie cards. Uh, chronology, uh, there you go, nice. And let's get rolling, guys. Uh, lot to look out for. Uh, we might miss some things and I'll just put them in the recap, of course. Here we go, Patrick Liney. So look at the cards, a very uh, prototypical, a little bit lighter than the usual cardboard of yesteryear. Uh, so that would be one difference, a little bit more glossy than yesteryear as well. Patrick Liney, uh, Spurgeon, Capocacco, Thomas Shabbat. And here we have our first marquee rookies, uh, and it'd be Calvin Turkoff, um, recruit. And this, I believe, would be one of the retro looking cards. And we've also hit our first of the uh, playing cards, really good looking playing cards this year. And it'd be Anze Kopitar. And here is a marquee legend, and it would be of Ray Bork. Eighth overall, wasn't he? Uh, okay, Connor Brown, Derek Steppen, and Radic Faxa. Continuing on. Man, these are just very plasticky, the uh, packages this year. Brandon Carlo, we have a Yarn Crook, we have Jenner, we have Ruby Hintz, <clears throat> uh, Kajula, and here would be our OPG Premier Tall Boy of Claude Giroux. There are also short prints of these, perhaps the rookies, etc. Uh, notice how it has the OPG Premier logo from the old school packs. Here's an old school pack from uh, 91. Nice. And then a Keith Yandel Retro, and we have our first high series, which would be a team checklist. Uh, Grizzlick and Philippe Deneau. So some of the photo variations would be, I believe, third jerseys or retro jerseys or something. All stars, I believe, as well. I just punched that corner out. Uh, Nick Jensen, Drew Doughty, Logan Couture, OV, nice one of OV, Tom Wilson, Manjapani, who's been great. Uh, there is Dominic Kubalik, and this would be one of our blue border uh, parallels. Kevin Fiala Retro, Sorensen, and James Neal. Nice. Now it's, it's probably impossible to figure out and sort out which ones are the other variations. Blank backs are easy. It's, it's actually really easy to uh, nick the corners of these while unwrapping this. The wrapper is cheaper than usual, I believe. Pellick, Cop. Patrick Kane, Gambrell, and we have a Patrice Bergeron Premier's Tall Boy. Nice. 
Chris Tierney, Morgan Geeky. So we have our first rookie here, or another rookie here. First base rookie, I believe. Morgan Geeky, Pollock, Anthony Mantha, and Corey Perry. Geeky, 67th overall by Carolina in 2017. York Strand, there's Carter Hart, nice. Gabe Landeskog, Broussard, uh, Iafalo. And here we have an Andre Kasha a retro. Nice. And we hit the Claude Giroux, nine of hearts. Interesting who to give the hearts to. Uh, should be heart contenders. <laughs> uh, team checklist, high series, Bennington and Yanni Gord. I love Yanni Gord, late bloomer, uh, energizer bunny. Diminutive player. And worked really hard to make it up into the show. Continuing on. Dandenov, Healers, there's Pasta, nice. Chernak, uh, Brandon Sad, and Nemisnikov, uh, Retro, Jeff Skinner, Blue, Fowler, Travis Dermott, and Nick Holden. All right, we've carved our way through the first column. You see in the background I have some Okuchi signatures for a good measure. TJ Oshi, Toffoli, Taylor Sagan, Ben Sherratt. Oh, we hit one of the draft picks. These are, I think, one of the um, it's puzzle pieces, I gather. I think they're some of the more common ones, the public puzzle pieces, about 19% of the time. Uh, nice, nice looking team checklist. Just black, gold on black, that's handsome. There's Marty Legend, Jeff Carter, Farabee, Paul Byron, and Ben Sherratt. And we did in fact receive one of the puzzle pieces. So we need the, I believe, nine pieces, right? Uh, in order to redeem the number one draft pick. Well, I'm not too, too fond of those, uh, those particular case cards, just because they take a lot of work. All right. Buckfist, Larson, Chris Kreider, uh, Edler, and we have a Nicholas Haig. Retro, and we hit the Jack Eichel. Jack Eichel's slowly but surely become one of my favorite players in the NHL because I had him in my pool last year and it was fantabulous. Uh, team checklist, so the other team checklist was a retro team checklist, I guess, and gather. So there you go, that's interesting. One's on white and one's black. Aaron Dell, Saros, and Dubnik. All right, I believe we have another blue here. Uh, Suzuki, Beldo, Smith, Larkin, Anders Nielsen. Uh, there's Nick Suzuki Blue Border, so that's nice. And the Nuge, Nugeification. Ben Pearson and Tyler Johnson. Tampa Bay has a nice mix of diminutive players and players of stature. Sandine and uh, Oh, wait, Pro Prohorkin, Haas, Grubauer, always injured, Blake Wheeler. There's Cam Talbot, retro. We have a Chibisov, probably undrafted. Uh, Pedersen, Markstrom, and Craig Smith. So there's the marquee rookie. So if you're wondering where the good rookies are, uh, there are these Chase 3D uh, rookie redemptions and cards. Uh, but typically the good, good rookies are not within the base uh, original OPG boxes, so you have to be mindful of that. Gosses, Beer, Bonino, Kelly Dubois, well, we don't even know the draft order yet. Uh, Jan Mark, um, there's Damon Severson, <clears throat> slowly but surely becoming a pretty decent player. And here is our Matt Roy, Matt Roy um, and it would be a red uh, border. So you, normally these are redemptions, but they're not this year. They used to be rapper redemptions. So that's kind of cool. Team checklist, high number, Kopvienko, Trocek, and Bovillier. All right. Vasilevsky, Lazat, Nieto, Cassian, and cool. This is awesome. So we hit the OPG Premier rookie, Liam Foody. Uh, this is a short prank, guys. Uh, I don't know the exact percentage of these, but I can tell you in a minute. Uh, but it's really cool to hit the OPG Premier Tall Boys. Tall Boys are awesome. I think they go back to the 1964 series of Parkhurst, Brett Pesci, Derek Stefan, and we do have this Dougie Hamilton, who's also one of my favorite players. 
uh, Stevenson and Vlasic. So that the foodie would be a short print. There are uh, super short prints, uh, doubly short prints, uh, like McDavid and so on. But that one would be a 41% of the time hit. So that's not bad, not bad. Uh, Rocco Grimaldi, McLeddy, Redman, uh, Sutter, Suter, Tyler Batuzzi, and then we have a league leader, a league leader high series of Leon is on the box, as well as Bobby Hull. We hit the Bobby Hull, that's nice. A little bit uh, follicle deficient there. Brendan Gallagher, Kyle Pamieri, and Matheson. I should look actually for blank backs because there are blank backs. And VC, Bjork, Zaka, Nate Schmidt, Quinn Yu's base card, now he's no longer a rookie. Uh, Mika Koivu, retro, and then we hit one of the season highlights. So it's King Henrik records number 450, so this would have been his 450th win. Ron Hainsey, nice, still around. Uh, this is a checklist. These are always cool checklists. And Varlamov, or Varlamov. These wrappers are like, stretchy, stretchy wrappers. Fox, Darnell Nurse, uh, Nudevara, uh, Patrick Nemeth, and we have a Brady Kachuk All-Star, Brady Kachuk All-Star Retro. So this would be number to 100 because it is one of the blacks. I think we're supposed to receive two of them. I don't know whether, which one was the other one, if I've seen it yet. Orlov, Soderberg, Darlene Stahl, and Alex Tuck. Alex Tuck is a Tuck, Tuck customer, Tuck customer. That's Tuck is just the kind of guy you want in the playoffs because he's money when it matters most. Uh, Brodine, Sezikis, Ryan Dezingle, Burkowski, and we hit the Nick Baxter OPG Premier Tall Boy. So this would probably be just a base one. Uh, this is a retro checklist, and we have the third cough, um, Marquee Rookie. Okay. And Kemper, Koskinen, and Barbashev. Just two packs left, guys. No Easter eggs for me, I don't think. And Claude Giroux, Nemesnikov, Makar, Nemeth, Paul Stashny. Slow down a bit, I find. There's Gino Malkin retro, nice. Uh, we have another league leaders of Leon. Brian Strom, we have Dominic Kubelik. We have a piece of plastic, which I should discard of. Last pack, guys. I believe our second black is in here. Let's see, guys. Uh, Pesci, McCabe, JT Miller, Noah Hannafin. We have a Claude Giroux Retro. We have the Jason Robertson a Blue Rookie. Nice. Uh, of course, the uh, brother of the other uh, Robertson, uh, Nick, I believe. Kind of cool. As I mentioned before, he's a Filipino-American uh, out of LA. Andrew Cox, so this one would be number 200 because it's a black border, retro. Brock Nelson, Verana, and Brett Conley. So that's basically it, guys. I'll do a quick recap. All right, guys, time for the recap. So we did receive two major stackages of the base. Here they are. Uh, I will say a couple of things. One thing is there are base variations, so do look for those. There's all-stars, there's throwback jerseys, there's purple jerseys for uh, Hockey Fights Cancer, photo variations, stuff like that. So keep an eye out for those. I do not know the entire checklist of that yet, so I wasn't sure whether I found any or had any. And we did receive our 12 high series cards. So boom, boom, boom. We have the checklist, league leaders, season highlights of the king. Uh, there's Bobby Hull had over 600 goals. Could have had 700 and up in the WHA. Uh, eighth overall in 79, Chibasov undrafted, and there's Morgan Geeky, who was 67th overall for Carolina in 2017. With regard to our retros, I see 16 here. I think we're supposed to have 18. There's Yandel, I mean, just a stack of these. There's the Nuge and Cam Talbot, Kasha. Boom. And we do have League Leaders of Dreisaitl. This really cool team checklist of the Golden Knights, which is black. I like the look of that. And there is Thurkoff, who's a Swiss-born player. He was a seventh rounder. He's played three NHL games, I think. Uh, so he would also be one of the retros. Now we do have two of the blacks, which are the numbered cards. So it's the black border retros, Kachuk and Kopp, number to 100, which is normal uh, for the festivities. I'll just place these two down here. 
And then with regard to our blue border parallels, they're light blue this time. We have Kubelik, Suzuki, Skinner, Stepin, and there's Jason Robertson, who was the 39th overall. And he played with the Frontenacs, but he's out of California, as you know by now. So there you go, boom. Oh, I found another one of the um, retros. Gino, hiding, bang. And then the OPG Premier Tall Boys, uh, going back to 1964 and apparently 1991, you see the emblems that say the same, the uh, Premier emblem. Uh, so we do have the Claude Giroux, we have the Nick Backstrom, the Patrice Bergeron, there's the Liam Foodie short print, which is like a 40% hit, 42%, something akin to that. Uh, he was on your London Knights and was an 18th overall and has given the Leafs uh, PTSD, of course. So boom. And let's toss in the red border card of Matt Roy, uh, who is out of Michigan, actually. I think he's out of Detroit. So one per box here. So there you go, there's Matt Roy. And the playing cards this year are really nice. I like the black design and it has a little OPG emblem in the middle. Uh, there's Jack Eichel, there's Anze Kopitar, and Dougie Hamilton's in there as well. So I'll just place them over there. And the hit of the box would be the puzzle piece, the unfortunate draft puzzle piece. Uh, the problem is OPG3, I'm missing another eight of these cards to do anything with it. So that's a little bit disappointing in a sense as far as chase cards goes. Although it's a cool thing, it's, you know, it's for kids, so there you go. So guys, hashtag Curry for the auto, uh, Yari Curry auto, I'll also throw in an OPG materials, triple materials, uh, quad materials. And I'm opening up this pack of OPG Premiers from 1991 before I go. Joe, Sakic, Vondra, Prop, uh, Mikella, Joe Mullen, Pierre Turgeon, and Brian Trotje. The car we were looking for, I guess, would be the Arrow Jagger, uh, right? Anyways, pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. I love it. So I just thought I'd toss this in there right now. There's the Sakic. Boom. That's it, guys. Please be sure to sub, like, and hashtag Dryden and Curry. I'm the full cards live and direct from Brooklyn, New York.